Hi, I'm Agne and this is Kilo Outsiders October Health News. October is named the Pink Month. Its goal is to educate us about breast cancer and raise awareness every year. Breast cancer is still most commonly diagnosed cancer type worldwide, accounting for one in eight diagnoses. Inventions and new technologies fighting this disease are always exciting news for the entire health industry. This fall, Dotplot won the prestigious UK James Dyson Awards 2022. It is a new tool to spot breast cancer at home. Dotplot assists women in performing self-checks of their breasts at home with ease, clarity and confidence. Users can build a custom map of their torso, just pressing the device to their chest and inputting the breast size. This technology is similar to mammograms or ultrasound scans. The device is also connected with the app and helps you track any abnormalities or suspicious changes. Medical professionals have welcomed the invention, but warn, it is no substitute for going to the doctor. What if medications were available for everyone? Mark Cuban, a serial entrepreneur and founder of Cost Plus Drugs, is working on solving this problem. His online pharmacy promises discounts for more than 800 prescription drugs for chronic diseases such as leukemia, dementia, or cancer. The prices are far lower, for around 80 to 85% as compared to what other retail pharmacies offer. For example, imatinib, medication for leukemia, in retail costs $2,500. Cost Plus Drug sells it for $14.40. The question is, why do we overpay for our medication? The patents for new drug formulas usually last around 20 years. After that, other companies can start to create generic versions of brand named drugs. Cost Plus Drugs team directly negotiates with manufacturers and gets the wholesale prices for their medication. They then sell it with only 15% markup, a 3% of pharmacy labor charge and $5 for shipping. Launched in January 2022, Cost Plus Drugs had a great start. In June, their online pharmacy webpage had already 9.5 million users. Hopefully, the further development of the company will disrupt the pharmaceutical industry and make life-saving drugs accessible for more people in need. Medicines called Vegovi or Ozempic seem to be a new trend among well-known people from Elon Musk to Kim Kardashian or influencers on TikTok. Why, you ask? It includes amaglutide, a compound that has shown to reduce 15% of body weight in patients that have used it. These medicines are typically used as injections for type 2 diabetes or chronic weight management in adults with obesity, high blood sugar or high cholesterol. Sure, sounds easy, no need to follow healthy diets or workout, just take an injection. However, doctors warn to be cautious on side effects, such as vomiting, bloating, constipation, or probably many more that haven't been researched and confirmed yet. Not to mention that people would have to spend around $1,300 per month to use these drugs. Are we really giving up on natural ways to lose weight, such as eating healthy foods, intermittent fasting or workout. We urge you to think twice before taking unknown paths or following unscientific advice. Is it health or beauty that you would choose first? Let's move to our speed round of health and wellness news. Time for a quick health digest. The total investment amount in health and wellness industry in October overstepped $1 billion. The total investments were around 15% higher as compared to September. 
The company View, developer of a smart glass for commercial buildings that improve human health, has raised $200 million and was the biggest investment round. Top 3 health and fitness apps by absolute download on the App Store were Pokemon Go, MyFitnessPal and Sweatcoin. On Google Play, ZepLife, Sweatcoin and Period Calendar. These were the most exciting health and wellness news of October. Remember to check the rest of the newsletter in your mailbox. Stay healthy and see you next month.